Good day, everybody. It's Max, and welcome back to American Truck Simulator. That's right. And in today's episode, well, we're still working on them achievements. <laughs> you betcha. Uh, we're trying to uh, knock off them past achievements that I kind of let go over the last year or so while I was playing so many other games and doing so many other things. Uh, but, of course, uh, we, uh, we're we trying to play catch-up. Uh, and, of course, now we got kind of Montana's achievements out of the way. I'm on my way back to go get Colorado's. And one of them is uh, four nacelles uh, for wind turbines. So in this case, uh, we're going to bring that up here on the screen. Boom, there we go. Uh, the freight market job is in progress, and I will bring up the world map here just to show that to you. Uh, so I actually picked up this load up here. Uh, just outside of Seattle and already took it down the five and a little bit down this way. And I mean, this is a big trip. <laughs> this is a big trip. Uh, it's going all the way down here do to do Colorado. Uh, so, uh, if we zoom in here a little bit, we're coming on down 84, almost all the way. Uh, so I just, uh, it's like, okay, well this part's a little bit, uh, I, I wouldn't say boring, but at the same time, it's not like you know, mega exciting. So uh, I thought, you know, we'll get through the, you know, kind of this part here. It's a little bit quiet, uh, but we're about to come in through Ontario and stuff. And then uh, we're going to be here uh, at Salt Lake City. Uh, I think I'll bring you back for that because we got to do an interchange change there. We're actually, uh, we're actually at a truck stop, a real truck stop uh, in, uh, in the map. Um... I can't remember the name of the truck stop in real life. Uh, what I'll do is maybe, uh, <laughs> uh, but this is very unrepresentative of the truck stop. So here you, you have an exit and there's the truck stop, right? Um, this is an entire, like, well, I wouldn't call it a town. I'd actually, it's not a, it's not big enough to be a city, but it's bigger than a town, right? I would call it a really large town. And like, this is a main street drag and all this stuff uh, where this truck stop is in real life, right? So uh, I thought this was a good place to start anyway, uh, just because I'm, uh, I don't even know what time it is. It's 2.01 in the morning. <laughs> okay. Well, I guess we're going to get started early, people. I guess we're getting started early. So <laughs> let's just get into it. Uh, and I'm going to probably have to do a couple of sound adjustments once we get going, uh, because there's no way for me to set this stuff up ahead of time sometimes. Wow. It's really dark. It's really dark. Um, time to get the job done. yeah, time to turn the lights on too. Right. Uh, so, uh, it is going to be really hard to see <laughs> what I'm doing here. Uh, so we have on the great big trailer with the great big nacelle on it, uh, with all the really big things. And I am driving the International I-990, you know it, uh, with the flames on there. Uh, so I thought I'd just, you know, again, a little different. A little, uh, you know, it's not my standard cab over uh, setup. Um, and again, this is uh, a truck that my father owned, so I, uh, I, I know this truck really well. Uh, so nevertheless, uh, we are fueled up. We're good to go. There's a little more light for you, right? So there's a little more light. Uh, so now we can actually, uh, uh, go into photo mode here and we can actually, uh, yep. Just show me the photo mode, dude. Show me the photo mode. All right. So we can, we can actually, uh, swing around here a little bit and, uh, take a look at it. Uh, pretty straightforward. Nothing. It's not like a super long trailer or anything. In fact, I'm kind of surprised. I figured this thing would weigh like way too much, <laughs> way too much, uh, for that trailer, but you know what? It's whatever the game spawns you got to deal with, right? So, in this case, let's get on the road. Uh, so, again, we got about a, oh, I don't know. We got about, let's say, um, a few hundred miles before there's anything real exciting going on. And this will give us time to chalk and the chat and the things, because that's all it's all about. Uh, so, October. Uh, wow. Where is the year going? Really, huh? Like, I mean, the year just kind of disappeared. <laughs> it really did. It's uh, it's kind of scary. Uh, so anyway, never, <laughs> nevertheless. Yeah, so like I said, this is a real truck stop. Uh, th this this truck stop, that, that sign that you see there in the upper corner, uh, that green truck up there, uh, that's, a real, that's a real sign uh, of, of a real truck stop place. And uh, so <laughs> you can look that up. Uh, so anyway, nevertheless... Uh, it's, it is October, and yeah, hurricanes, all the things, holy smokes. Uh, so, whew, wow. Uh, 
you know, I, I, we got found found the crazy problems with the house there in August, right? And was spending all the effort I had to fix that. Now that was a very unexpected and unfortunate turn of events, and it is what it is, right? I mean, you know, sometimes you got to deal with stuff that's 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 real life. And so, you know, and I did all that work myself. So, you know, the jacking up of the house corner, uh, you know, taking all the old lumber out, uh, putting all the new 2 by 10s in, uh, you know, fixing uh, the corner wall pieces, and then, of course, putting in all new floor, all new wall, blah, blah, blah. Uh, and, I had, and I did that all in, I don't know, five weeks. And I mean... You know, you're you're working, you're doing that. Uh, you know, you're making, you're playing games almost every day. Uh, it's it's very draining. It, it it was very draining, and uh, uh, so it was it was intense. It was intense, people. It was intense, like an eight. You know, because it's very intense. Uh, yeah, give me give me all the things. Uh, so uh, there's an eight for you. Uh, so in this case, it uh, it was very intense, and I think I got really worn down. I got really super worn down, and so I, I, then of course, uh, literally uh, at the end of August, there uh, we went on the family vacation, and literally the second I got back, I was sick. And I mean, I wasn't just a little sick. I was I was not well. <laughs> I was not good. Uh, turns out I don't think it was the, you know, the thing that, you know, gets blamed a lot. Uh, in this case, I think it was just your standard, like, seasonal flu. Um, so in this case, I got seasonal flu with the, um, uh, with strep throat. And, uh, it got real nasty after that. Uh, so, <laughs> and it, and I, and I probably should have went and seen, like, got some medical help, uh, but I didn't, and that it is what it is. Uh, I mean, you know, I did what I did, and that you know, consequences. Consequences was I was sick for over for three weeks. Uh, then, uh, gee whiz, didn't somebody say, you know what, you're 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 not having a hard enough time, Max. Uh, you should have a hurricane. <laughs> okay, why don't you throw me a hurricane? See what I can do with that. Mm, uh, sure. Uh, so, hurricane. Hurricane was a thing, <laughs> and, uh, uh, yep, gee whiz. Uh, so obviously, hurricanes are definitely no joke, um, you know, and now, I, I mean, one, um, it wasn't my first rodeo of a hurricane, and two, uh, like, you know, it's one of them things here on the east coast of Canuckland, uh, we do get a hurricane about once every five years, um, it's just the way it is. <laughs> it's, it is what it is. Uh, you live on. Uh, you live uh, uh, along the ocean uh, in North America. Um, well, I mean, they have typhoons in the Pacific Ocean, uh, but in the Atlantic Ocean, if you live along the ocean, you're going to get a hurricane uh, in North America. It's just the way it is, uh, and and you, you got to prepare for that. And I am. I've always been very well prepared for uh, hurricanes. Uh, so of course. Uh, everything we put away, uh, got out my straps, everything was strapped down, all the things, look at this guy, see, this is why you got to watch for AI traffic, it's always really bad. Uh, so, of course, we, uh, we did the things and the stuff. Uh, I am driving 96 miles an hour. <laughs> no wonder. Game. Uh, let's take it easy, right? Um, is that okay? Can we do that? All right, what are we doing here? Oh, we're going uphill now. Okay. Uh, I was going to say, why Why is everything going by so fast? Uh, well, it's going by so fast, Max, because you're literally drooling 100 miles an hour. That's 160 kilometers an hour, big guy. Uh, do you think you might want to slow that down a little bit? Sure. All right, cool. Uh, so, uh, yeah. Uh, so, of course, uh, I, you know, tying everything down. Uh, you know, I, like I said, I have generators, all that stuff here and I was prepared, you know, uh, now we weren't, we weren't going to be able to do, uh, live streams every day, all that stuff. That just wasn't going to happen. Uh, but I was preparing to do a couple of live streams, uh, for extended periods of time. Um, and of course I provided updates on the socials while everything was going on. And, uh, you know, we, I did, I did very well, um, 
you know, very little property damage. Again, it was just a few trees, no biggie. <clears throat> Those trees, of course, I've, uh, uh, you know, when you're, you know, I, on the property, uh, there was no real, there was no real emergency or anything like that. Um, the tree, like I said, I, I have property that has hundreds of trees on it, right? Uh, so these two trees were close, close to where there's, uh, the property is cleared. Uh, but not even close to the house or anything like that. Everything was fine there. And overall, just uh, pretty straightforward. Uh, just, you know, it just clean up and then waiting for the electricity to come back. Uh, because, of course, you can't have a strong, powerful hurricane uh, and not expect to lose electricity. And <clears throat> I was very lucky. I was very lucky to get the electricity back. So with that... Uh, well, I mean, I, I mean, it did take a couple of days. <laughs> it was off for a few days. Uh, but even, even now, it's been a couple weeks since that hurricane. And there are still people here without power due to that hurricane. Uh, and that's the way it is. Like, you, you know, you just kind of kind of cross your fingers and toes and hope that, um, you know, that the damage done. You know you're going to lose power, but what you're hoping for is that, it isn't direct so like for example you hope that it's that whatever what damage you take is the power pole that your house is directly attached to isn't destroyed or the power mast going to your house isn't ripped off uh, or anything like that right because that's bad <laughs> that's not good that's not good people i'll tell you right now it's just not good so when uh, so in this case, uh, I had done lots of prep work, like I've done many times before, and sure enough, no problems, no problems whatsoever. Uh, we're getting some nighttime shots here on the A camera. It seems to be a little upset that I can't get a good bead on uh, on a front view. Oh yeah, now it was going to give me the front view just as I switched it over. Well, gosh darn it. Um, uh, whatever. Uh, it is what it is. Sometimes you just got to go with it, people. Sometimes you just got to go with it uh, when you're driving 87 miles an hour. I think we, I really I really should slow that down a little bit. There. Uh, you know, I mean, don't get me wrong. <clears throat> I got no problem driving 80 miles an hour. I am perfectly fine with this. Uh, that being said, um, you know, this, this, this uh, wind turbine nacelle isn't exactly the most stable load <laughs> ever. And, uh, you know, I'm, I'm just kind of blasting through the dark here. Right, it's perfectly fine. Everything is fine. Uh, in fact, I'm not so sure about the fineness at the moment. I was pretty sure we were staying on the interstate, uh, but I see we're now on Highway 30. When did that happen, people? When did that? Did I take a wrong turn somewhere? Uh, you know what? Let's check the map. Uh, let's do that. Um, okay, we're coming through by. Oh, okay. So uh, Highway 84 and Highway 30 are the same thing. Okay, that's fine. I'm. I'm okay with this. I'm okay with this. But as you can see, it's a long way. It's a really long way. I chose a big load for a long way. Uh, but th uh, but this is what I had to do. I you know to get you know to get these achievements. Some of this stuff is not located close by. <laughs> In fact, it's really far away. Uh, so you know, uh, and and that's okay. I guess you know you got to do what you got to do. Uh, so. Crazy house repair. Good thing I repaired the house before the hurricane, huh? Like, holy smokes. Like, <laughs> it might got messy. Uh, house repair, mega sick, uh, all the things, and then the hurricane. Uh, that takes us to October. And now, of course, um, you know, now, fall in Canuck Land isn't that bad, right? Uh, it is, there, it is uh, turkey weekend here in Canuck Land. Uh, we love Turkey Weekend. <laughs> uh, yeah, Thanksgiving uh, Thanksgiving Day weekend here in Canuckland. Uh, we have ours about a month uh, before the Americans do. So, of course, uh, ours is this weekend. And, yeah, I mean, it's going to be, I mean, turkey's awesome. <laughs> Yay, turkey. You betcha. Uh, in fact, uh, you know, I was, uh, like, talking with some of the uh, people in chat, obviously. Uh, and, of course, your, Europeans don't really celebrate Thanksgiving because, you know, Thanksgiving, the new world, the whole nine yards. Um, I told them they, they got to start making up some holidays over there. <laughs> so uh, they need some excuses to eat more turkey. Uh, that's, my, that's my whole theory. <laughs> like, just because you don't have Thanksgiving 
doesn't mean you don't can't like be thankful for something, right? Uh, call it a day of thanks and have turkey with that. I think that's an awesome idea, right? I mean, there's nothing wrong with turkey. Turkey is great. Turkey is the bomb. So yeah, I would say you know if you need to, if you need to, people. Oh, there's a nice shot. That was a nice shot, wasn't it? Yeah, do that. Nice. Look at that. Yeah, I mean, if you need to make something up for turkey, people, then you do what you got to do. You do what you got to do for turkey, because it's turkey. Uh, you know, just make things happen. Uh, so <laughs> that was my that was my answer to that. Sometimes you might need a holiday. And yes, I, okay, I can understand the whole maybe there's no Halloween over there or anything like that. But again, it's not that you and your friends can't make up your own, uh, like, festivities. Uh, sometimes you got to make up your own stuff. Because the world won't give it to you, right? <laughs> and the world owes you nothing. Uh, you just missed the turn, Max. You blew it. Big time, dude. Uh, not good. Not good at all. Um, well, I mean, you're going to you're gonna come up here to Highway 15. Uh, I mean, it only adds a few extra miles, I guess. Uh, just don't miss this next one because you were talking too much. <laughs> Gee whiz. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay, so we were gonna we were getting into the uh, location at seven uh, seven fifteen. I see now the time has gone back up to seven fifty three. Uh, yeah, well, it is what it is. Miss you miss a turn. You miss a turn. That's just the way it goes. Uh, so uh, let's see what we can get here for a few more camera angles, shall we? Uh, are we gonna be safe enough to do that? Uh, we probably are, right? Uh, there's a little bit of a back shot for you. Uh, of course, with a little bit of front shot for you. Uh, it's pretty, uh, pretty nice drive going on here. This nice little straight stretch. Room. There we go. There's a nice eight shot. Uh, I guess I better get over a little bit. Uh, there we go. Yep. Nice eight shot there. All right. Uh, because, of course, the sun is coming up. Uh, let's do a little bit of side shooting while we're driving this next part. Okay. Uh, yeah, I get a nice little look at the truck there. Is it? Just kind of cruises up along the road. Yeah, I know. I'm, I'm, I'm lane hogging. Oops. <laughs> well, uh, learn to deal with it, people. Learn to deal with it. Uh, let's kill off that one mirror there, just so as we get a little more view and a little more scenery, I think. Uh, so, yeah, it's uh, it's been a pretty crazy couple of months, and that is uh, that's just the way it is. Now, Let's talk about the Discord server. Yeah. Uh, so the Discord server is up and running. Uh, and, of course, it is in the video description. Uh, and I want to thank those who have already joined the server. Um, <laughs> it's really cool. I didn't think anybody would join that stuff. Right? I mean, don't get me wrong. I, I mean, I, you know, I, 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 it's not like I didn't expect nobody to join it. Uh, but at the same time, I didn't expect many people to join it. Uh, but that's, uh, that's a thing. Uh, you know. Uh, which is actually pretty cool, uh, I must admit. Uh, so I'm I'm very I'm very pleased to see uh, people joining the Discord server and doing Discordy things. Uh, of course, I try to shout on there all the time as much as I can. I get a little time each day to check that out. Uh, again, videos are my hobby, not my life. Right? Like this isn't uh, this isn't this isn't a paycheck or anything for me. Right? So. Ooh, stay to the right, dudes. Stay to the right. Uh, so in this case, uh, you know, I'm doing whatever I can. I'm doing whatever I can. Uh, you better slow down here, Max, because this is a really sharp turn. Like, gee whiz. Holy smokes. Um, there we go. Yeah, we'll just get over here now. Uh, so, yeah, it's it actually is really cool. Yeah, thanks, AI driver. Whatever. Uh, <laughs> it, is, uh, it is actually really cool that uh, people are joining up. Uh, saying hi. We're having big discussions about Jeff. Uh, Jeff is number one. Jeff is the man. Uh, well, he's the robot in one game. Uh, you know, and, and Jeff may be or may not be sleeping in another game. Uh, and Jeff in in uh, <laughs> in in Railgrade uh, appears to be some sort of executive. I mean, I'm really glad for Jeff. That means he's gotten a promotion. Right? Uh, so we talk about Jeff all the time uh, while we... Uh, uh, all trucks right lane. Psh, whatever. Um, uh, we talk about Jeff all the time on the Discord server. And, you know, Jeff's important, right? 
Uh, but of course, on in the captain, Jeff the robot is very important. Um, as of the making of this video, we just got Jeff back. You betcha. I wasn't letting General Bum let keep Jeff. No way. Uh, yeah, I'm bypassing the scale anyway, dude. Uh, let's uh, let's just let's just be clear here. I was never stopping in the first place. Uh, but yeah, I saved Jeff from General Doofenshmirtz or. General whatever his name is uh, and sure enough in the captain and sure enough uh, we have Jeff back on board he's super happy I'm super happy we're all super happy and uh, of course uh, if you haven't seen that episode go watch it because we rescue Jeff and that's important and uh, so now of course we're on our way uh, to the home world of Umix uh, which of course is uh, gonna make a quick stop over Hopefully, uh, hopefully, Mr. Umix uh, and the and his homeworld are going to be kind of nice to us uh, because we need a little niceness in our lives. Yeah, we need niceness. Uh, that's a thing. So you know, because it's uh, it's tough stuff. It's really tough stuff. <laughs> uh, and you know, I've just had to deal with a lot of stuff in the last couple of episodes of the Captain. And I don't want to give too, you know, I don't want to give heavy spoilers away here, right? So. You know, if, you know, if you need to know what's going on about how we got, you know, we saved Jeff, how we lost Jeff, all the Jeffy things, then you should be watching the captain because, you know, Jeff, uh, Jeff is important. Uh, Jeff is, you know, a number one and that's <laughs> he's important. And of course, we discussed Jeff in discord. Uh, and I, and like I said, it's really cool that people are joining discord and we're having discussions on Jeff. Uh, so I must admit that's pretty nifty. Uh, so with that, uh, I think what I'll do is uh, we'll do an, a quick eight here on this quick straight stretch. Oh, yeah. There we go. Nice. Uh, while I get ready to pass this car. There we go. Uh, so now I'm going to bring you back. Uh, and um, when I do, it will be for something that's going on in the world because this is a pretty boring stretch of highway. So <laughs> hold on a sec. Okay, we've just arrived in Utah uh, not too long ago. We're coming into Ogden, and, uh, of course, we've just merged back on to the uh, fifth, uh, on back onto the 84. So this is the I-15-84 duplicity line, and then we're going to drive down here a little bit uh, and then drive back off of this. And <laughs> hopefully don't miss the exit this time, Max, because, oh, gee, detours. Detours are expensive and things. Um... And, uh, yeah, so we're coming through here on Logan. Uh, do, 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 yeah, uh, cruise along. Boy, I, I really slowed down for that exit ramp. Uh, <laughs> I shouldn't have slowed down so much. I was really concerned about the exit ramp on the, on, 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 on the merging. But, and, and, and it's funny because I don't usually do that much slowdown. I mean, come on, you people have watched me. All right, so, uh, well, I was, I was keeping left anyway. <laughs> Let me tell you. I definitely wasn't wasn't gonna make I'm not again it's your your port of entry flag is it's very cool don't get me wrong it's great uh, but I have no intention of stopping here uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. yep that's perfectly fine uh, so <laughs> yeah here we are as you can see down there in the bottom corner um, uh, did you just say exit right uh, I think you did uh, let's do the zoom in yeah you did too because we got to go to Cheyenne uh, so we'll do that. Uh, there we go. Uh, you know, on the odd occasion, and there goes the sign there. Uh, I think that was the, oh, gee whiz. Now that was the one. See, now I slowed down too much for that last exit ramp and not enough for this one. Um, uh, duh. Anyway, is what it is, dudes. Um, just get it on, I guess. Uh, let's get that zoom back out here so I can, <laughs> so I can watch for all the major turns that are coming up here. Uh, so with that, yeah, just coming through these uh, couple of cities, I wanted to bring you back, uh, just because we, we were doing like, may, you know, we were doing all these, uh, different interchange changes, right? Like we were merging on to the 15 and merging back off to get off down to the 84 and, da, 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 and all the things. Yeah. Just something, uh, you know, stare at a little bit. Uh, looks like you got to, Oh, look at this nice straight stretch here. I mean, we've got to be able to get some nice eight shots on this, right? I mean, this is an eight shot. Yeah, come on, man. I mean, this has got eight shot written all over it. There we go. Look at that. Oh, man. That's some really nice eight shooting. <laughs> oh, look at this shot. Yes. Yes. Do that. Do that. Yep. 
Ah, uh, yeah, we're getting some good driving now. Good drive, good drive all around, you betcha. Uh, so, <laughs> okay, we got some curves, there's some hills. Yeah, it's not, it's not like, uh, you know, something super thrilling. Um, we're out here in the mountains, and I'm sure we'll be uh, driving along. Uh, we'll bring you back uh, once we get a little closer to something uh, a little more city-like, uh, just to see what's going on. Okay, we're coming into Cheyenne, and uh, we'll be making a highway switch here shortly. Uh, yeah, because then we're on our way to Denver. You betcha. Yeah, we got to exit right, do all the exit right things. Uh, so we got to slow down here a little bit. Uh, so uh, what do we got coming up for the rest of the year? I'm telling you, it's crazy, isn't it? Uh, so obviously October, very busy with the captain and uh, rail grade. And uh, I'm at man, rail grade. What a surprise game that turned out to be. Actually, both games have turned out to be uh, very pleasant surprises. <laughs> this was not what I had planned. Uh, for October uh, into November. Um, but both games turned out to be such pleasant surprises. I'm, you know, I, I went with the flow because uh, sometimes you got to do that. Um, uh, so obviously we, uh, we have gone with the flow uh, with, <laughs> with the captain and rail grade and both the games I'm really having a great time with. Uh, rail grade, I'm loving the puzzles. Um, and uh, thanks to Chi, I, I, I also got through uh, trying out what I would call sandbox mode. Basically, you just got to go into a puzzle and let the time run out, right? Um, you know, just just take one of the uh, just take one of the puzzle pieces and just don't do it, or um, or whatever, right? And then you can and then you can play on that map as long as you want. Uh, yeah, and you're good to go. Uh, so I must admit. That's one way to do it, and I'm I'm having a great time with the puzzles. Uh, I don't know; it's just a really, really fun train game uh, that doesn't take a lot of your time up. Now, yes, I mean it does take a little bit of my time up because you know I'm trying to prep things a for streaming and all the stuff. But I think for the average player, um, it, it it it's it's just fine, right? Like you know. You play, uh, let's say, let's say you even do, oh, we're just coming to Colorado. Uh, we're getting closer to, we're getting closer all the time, people. Uh, so I think, I think it was just a lot of fun. It's just a fun game. It was a fun game overall. And uh, so we're, we got lots of that coming back, uh, continuing on into October. Uh, between the captain and that, uh, that's going to take us into mid-November. And of course, uh, mid-November... Uh, is when Zion will start. Now, I don't know if that's how you actually... Like, no one... I have not been able to find out the pronunciation of this game yet. So I am going with that, people. That's what I'm going... I'm going with Zion, okay? Um, I-X-I-O-N, right? Um, again, it's a... It, it, and, it, and it is a slightly different uh, journey altogether than all these games... Uh, it is very much like Frostpunk 2, uh, with a combination of a few uh, space station sims where you get to work inside a space station type deal with a lot of, uh, with some extra outside stuff as well. Um, and, and I think that's going to, and, and that's going to take, take a little time to play. That will play, uh, take us probably to the end of the year. Uh, obviously, we still have Icarus Monday, and uh, we're we're going to be playing a, I mean, ATS Sunday on the odd occasion. Uh, ATS may not happen every Sunday, but uh, it's definitely going to happen, um, you know, on Sunday, like Sundays uh, throughout moving forward, right? Uh, every Sunday, every once in a while, we're going to have an, uh, either do it live or like this, for example, on a holiday weekend, uh, because I don't always. Uh, do a full weekend schedule and the reason is is that there's just so many so many streamers doing streams Friday and Saturday and Sunday that it's just too crowded it really is quite crowded <laughs> on the weekends um, so like for example like there's like several streamers that 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 stream on Friday and Sundays and even Saturday even Saturday, like when I stream on Saturday, uh, my, uh, my my count is much lower than throughout the week, right? So like I might get like one person in chat, one or one or two 
uh, people in chat on the weekend. Whereas, like, during the weekday, like, I can, I can have, like, even dozens, uh, you know, or whatever. Again, I'm a small channel, right? So <laughs> when you say, wow, you get dozens of people in chat. Yeah, that's actually a big thing, people, and you just better stick with it. Uh, yeah, get out of the way, Car. Um, listen, it's, 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 it's. AI traffic. I don't feel sorry for it at all. Uh, so we're coming in through Denver. I'm assuming this is Denver, right? Uh, yes, it is. Um, and I'll tell you right now, I don't, I'm not really liking the scale of Denver. <laughs> like, I thought they, they should have more stuff here. I mean, it's Denver, right? Um... Yeah, keep left. Thanks, thanks for telling me that. It's a good thing I knew that AI um, or GPS lady. Like I knew to keep left, uh, but you didn't tell me that until the very last second, did you? No, holy smokes! Like that could have been a lot worse. All of a sudden, because let me tell you, I would have blamed you for everything. Um, yeah, I mean, don't get me wrong. Uh, you know, like, uh, the, uh, the scenery here in Denver is re is done really well in a whole nine years. And I mean, yeah, like, the Denver skyline is really, really good. Uh, it's just, it's too bad we couldn't drive downtown. Like, like, there's no way to drive downtown into that downtown De Denver. Like, that, I mean, that would be really awesome if we could, like, have one road where we had to go, like, deliver downtown in Denver. Because that would just be awesome, right? I mean, look at the city. I mean... They do that, like, it's the same as, like, California, L.A., and stuff like that. Like, at least some of L.A., they let you drive into, right? Like, like down on the beachfront and stuff like that. But we can't get anywhere as close to Denver. It's like, yeah, you know, here's your truck stop outside of Denver and a rail station. Well, whoop de ding do, <laughs> right? Uh, so, boy, did I ever get off topic here, didn't I? Uh, so, yeah, I mean, it's just, uh, I don't know what it is. It's, uh, it is what it is. Uh, so, <laughs> back on topic, while we're having a look at a few eight shots here, um, it, it, it would be nice. Uh, it's going to be nice uh, for uh, November. We're going to get Zion in, uh, which, of course, uh, I'm assuming that we'll be probably wrapping up uh, one of two games, either the captain or rail grade at that point in time. Wow, I better... Just don't take this turn too sharp, Max. Okay, we better do this for a minute, too, because you're taking that, sure, taking that turn really sharp. Uh, so, in this case, we're... Uh, yeah, we're going to have a couple of games like that. Uh, of course... Uh, Star, uh, Starfield was going to be uh, part of the Christmas season, but I am not surprised when they announced that. Their first announcement was Christmas season of 2022, so I am not surprised that uh, they delayed that to 2023. Uh, and, and who knows when we'll get to see that. Uh, it's just the way it is. Uh, obviously, Icarus Monday uh, is going to continue as Icarus Monday. Uh, I still have... I don't know. I have what? Probably. Oh, let's say uh, four missions. Four. Well, no, three or four missions. Yeah, let's say four missions that I still have to do that I that I would enjoy doing. Uh, and it turns out they're now uh, going back through the Olympus missions. Uh, and redoing a bunch of those, uh, which of course we're going to be doing, uh, which I'm going to be replaying. Like for example. Uh, the mission on Monday is a, a, a former Olympus mission, which we used to speed run for cash. Now, it's not it's not the speed run for exotics. This would be the uh, the three plant mission uh, where you would speed that for cash. Like if you needed some quick money uh, at the beginning of the game, because that mission was you collected three plant samples and then you you you. Basically, you just speed run the three plant samples, and then you would jump back on the rocket. And in fact, uh, you always landed at like I think it was always like 7 a.m. And if you once you got really good at it, it was only like it only took like what do you mean? Why are we turning? What are we turning? Oh, we're here! Holy smokes! We've <laughs> we're actually here, people. Um, yeah. So we would. Uh, uh, well, I gotta get over here. Sorry, UPS guy. I gotta cut you off. Uh, it's it is what it is. Okay, uh, so, yeah, uh, <laughs> I've lost my train of thought now. Uh, do, 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 do. Well, anyway, I was talking about something, <laughs> and uh, whatever it was, uh, see, it was like, holy smokes, i got to make a turn here because we got to drop this load off. Uh, it's intense. 
Um, let me see. I was talking about Starfield. I was talking about games we're playing. Anyway, it's not going to come to me. <laughs> no, it's not going to come to me now. Um, anyway, uh, yes, we're going to play some games. We're going to do some stuff. Um, oh, Icarus. Right, Icarus. Yes, and uh, see... It came back. It came back. It's fine. Um, yeah. So we're uh, we're doing Icarus, uh, and they're like I said, they're redoing some of the Olympus maps, uh, and we're and one of the maps that we're going to redo is wow. I like how that truck just came out of nowhere. That was very sneaky of you. Yeah. You know what? You can wait there, buddy. Yeah. Listen, AI driver. I don't care who do. Uh, so, gee, look, distracted again. Icarus, mission, right. Uh, if you were doing a, a quick run, uh, in fact, if you were doing that quick run, uh, you could actually do that in 15 minutes for that cash, right? And, I mean, it wasn't a lot of money. Um, well, in fact, they even dropped it. They nerfed that mission. I think it was $150, and then they nerfed it. Uh, but that's all right. It's fine. Um, you know, but you could do it in 15 minutes. So you could, like, I mean, if you needed quick cash, you could run that mission a dozen times, like, like in one evening or something like that, and then build up some, some money, right? Um, but they've reworked that mission and many others, and we're going to be doing that mission and many of the others. You betcha. Uh, we're going to run all these missions. Okay final road uh so obviously we have you know icarus coming up uh we'll be playing to the end of the year obviously and beyond um i it'd be it'd be kind of nice if they announced dlc uh you know a per, like yes they gave us the first one free and but i don't expect them to do that again and that and you know it that is what it is um but uh if they had another dlc coming up uh, with uh, some stuff, and I'm assuming they're waiting for dedicated server to do that. Uh, I, I'm assuming that's what they got to go with. So it is what it is. Uh, so we have now arrived at destination. Get ready to turn right. Yeah, get ready to turn right. Wow, I can't believe. <laughs> yeah, thirteen. I, I don't know how many how many miles was this thing? Uh, just one second. Switch to the other screen, Max. Yeah, um, do, 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 do. it was 4,100, 41 hours. I was, I'm pretty sure it was like 1,400 miles or something like that. It was a crazy amount of miles this thing was. I know that. Uh, yep, we're turning right. There we go. There we are. And are you going to give me some aid action? Uh, like some decent aid action if I, if I try to do this on this dirt road? I don't know. I don't think you can do it. Come on. You you, you want to do it. Oh, look at this nice piece of straight stretch up here. Like, it'd be really nice if it gave me some 8 action. Uh, I mean, don't get me wrong. It's giving me the 8 action. Oh, there it is. There it is. All right, we're happy now. I'm happy now. <laughs> All right, I can, I can go back to 2. I'm good to go. Uh, wow, they really want this thing in here in the woods, don't they? Okay, that's fine. Uh, let's get a little bit of side action here. We we should be pretty safe from most traffic coming in here, right? Is it four more miles? Like, what are you talking about four more miles? Like, you couldn't have got me a shorter road into where they want this nacelle at? I mean, this is a pretty bouncy road. It's a wonder this trailer isn't dragging all over the place. Uh, sure. Okay, here we go. Do the turn. Wow, the big crane see-through. There we go. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Uh, yep. Uh, we have arrived, people. Uh, or no, we haven't arrived. <laughs> I thought we had arrived, but nope. That's just crane number one. This is crane number two. A um, little bit more, Max. A little bit more. Come on. There's the green light. There it is. Yeah, <laughs> you can... You can do it. All right, here we go. Listen, GPS girl. Like, don't be lippy. I will turn you off. <laughs> Holy smokes. Uh, what do we got? Uh, 15, 15, 40. All right, we'll do, we'll do 40. Uh, oh, really? You mean 40 that was like 400? Sure, that's fine. 
Like, that's not a 40. That's probably more of a 90 scenario. But whatever. Like, sometimes you get the craziest, craziest spots. Uh, anyway, let's see if we can't uh, make this happen. Yep, we're going to swing this around this way. And then we're going to swing you. Swing, better, better, better. Swing, 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 better, better. Here we go. Yep. Uh, I don't think you, you didn't bring it down far enough, Max. Darn it. Yep. Listen, you're going to bring this around this way, dude. Because you, 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 you gone dong goofed up on that one. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, no. Yeah, you, 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 you goofed up on this one, Max. You, you really didn't bring it around fast enough. Well, can you fix this or are you going to make a big mess of it here for five minutes? I mean, you could just fix it. Yeah, all right, let's do that because then this is going to get real messy if I don't. Uh, so let's just swing over here and then swing it back around like this. There you go. And then swing it back around like this. Yeah, that's it. Now, see, now, see, now you can do something with this, right? There you go. Now you can actually, like, try to park a trailer. And it's actually not going to hit the container, right, guys? Not going to hit the container, right? Sheesh. Uh, yeah, you got to bring it around now. You got to come around a little faster, dude. There you go. Nice. Okay, we'll just straighten her up and then we'll put her in there. <laughs> wow, dude. Did you see that guy in the windshield? Like, look at his arms flipping around in there. I'm a little <laughs> worried. I might have just broken his arm. Um, yeah, dudes. Uh, yeah, I didn't mean for you. <laughs> I didn't want, I wasn't trying to break your arm there, dude. I just want you to swing the truck tires around here. Like, why the, why the flailing arms on the driver? Like, I'm not trying to, I'm, dude, I'm not trying to set you up that hard. Like, you know, craziness. There we go. Look at that. That is a T drop. You betcha. Uh, anyway, I'm sure they'll be happy. Look at that. Achievement progress, 204. So we're in a, we're just working on progress, people. We're just working on progress. It's what it is. Uh, as we are now trying to get caught up on some achievements. I'm Max. This, of course, has been American Truck Simulator. That's right. ATS Sunday, 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 where we drive trucks on Sunday. Uh, you betcha. And uh, I hope all my Canuck friends are, uh, you know, enjoying uh, the Canuck turkey and all the things. Uh, this long weekend along with myself and of course for everybody else i appreciate all the viewing and the th hanging out and all the things and i will see you on the next one take care